As we all know, the only thing more accurate than star signs are BuzzFeed quizzes, but today, I ratio all of them by telling you exactly what your favorite gun says about you. This video is proudly sponsored by the American Hunters Against Horses Association. Thinking is hard, and you don't like to do it. KISS would be your motto if you could remember what all the letters stand for. You keep your friends close and your enemies closer, not for the sake of strategy, but simply because you didn't know they were there. The life of the party, your friends are as delighted to have you around as they are tired of getting called at 3am to help you out of another jam. Consider yourself a modern classic, but everyone around you just thinks you're basic. Stuck in your ways, you haven't bought a different brand of clothing since 11th grade, and swear Ed Hardy is making a comeback. You love starting conversations with strangers, no matter the environment, but can never seem to think of any topics to discuss outside of the latest podcast you're binging. Sponsored by MeUndies. And while you can often be headstrong, you are also loyal to a fault, with there being nothing that you wouldn't do for your friends. It's not that you're not trying, it's just that you haven't really found what you're good at yet. You swear by your ability to multitask, but often find yourself getting tunnel vision as you fall down pointless rabbit holes. And although you take good care of yourself, you constantly struggle to even start important tasks like paying bills, taking out the trash, and changing your oil. Your mother has never had a phone call go anywhere but to your voicemail, which you haven't changed since college. She says to call her back, Darren. It's, uh... It's about your father. You gotta spend money to make money! Is your motherfucking motto, and who the fuck cares if you've lost an obscene amount of it investing in crypto? It's the goddamn future, dude, and you can't be on the forefront of a revolution without taking a few risks. You wake up with a hustler mentality, and you've got your grind set right before your feet even hit the goddamn floor. It's time for breakfast. You slam 10 egg whites and a fistful of magnesium supplements, washing it all down with a can of G Fuel. Now you're ready to tackle the day with the force of a thousand tates. No, no time, time or energy, energy for the haters, you march to the beat of your own Drift Funk Spotify playlist. Introverted to the core, you value your privacy and personal space, and have a tendency to keep even the people closest to you at arm's length. Unfortunately, this can sometimes lead to people perceiving you as rude or unfriendly, as well as hampering your ability to collaborate with others. People that need to always stay busy confound you, as you are perfectly content to sit quietly alone with your thoughts of which there are very few. You also have a strong affinity for nature, likely for going modern forms of entertainment for activities like meditation, hiking, and trail running. Oh, and probably camping. You are basically a bird. Boy, well, you're sure a dumb bird. Anything new is shiny. Anything shiny must be acquired. If there's a trend, you're the first to join. But since your attention span is shorter than the Zoomer fresh off an all-day YouTube short binge, you're also the first to abandon it. And also, like a bird, you really do have a tendency to preen. Maybe keep an eye on that instead of the mirror. You don't want people thinking you're vain. You were probably homeschooled, raised by fundamentalist parents that also suffered from agoraphobia, or both. Growing up as the most sheltered kid of your generation, the few friends you do have now often wonder if the weirdness is innate or simply an awkward cry for attention. Perfectionistic to the point of insanity, you often find yourself googling words that you already know how to spell, just to make absolutely sure, because maybe the autocorrect stopped working and you don't want to look stupid on the internet because that stuff stays around forever and then one day you die with the only legacy you'd have left behind being a digital testament to your ignorance and idiocy. Fucking sub- Nah, 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 wait a minute. A thousand? A thousand of you listen to Kermit? That is amazing. Thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. You are fantastic and I am so glad you like what I'm making. Don't worry, I'm still getting all the testing done for the follow-up video on the topic of our resident legendary hunters causing drops in frame rate. I will hopefully have that done sometime next week. And now that I am a proper content creator with my thousand subscribers, I would like to invite you all to my Discord. Link in the description. I have a lot of fun stuff planned, so if you haven't already... <clears throat> I said, if you haven't already... Um... Kermit? Fucking subscribe!